All right. Hey, first and foremost, giving all praise, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rekakwadash. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone, of whom I learn from daily. And a healthy shalom to the brothers that are out there doing the work in truth and sincerity. This is going to be one interesting lesson. Just, uh, you know what? I think I'm going to entitle it an advertisement under an elders video. <laughs> no, it sounds weird. Let's just get into it. This won't be long at all. It might be five minutes. It might be 10 minutes. It might be 30 minutes. You never know. This is very, very interesting. This is Psalms 119 and 104. Through thy precepts, I get understanding. Therefore, I hate every false way. You hear that? Through thy precepts, I get understanding. Therefore, I hate every false way. Now, let's go ahead and go straight to it. Now, I'm five minutes in to the elder uh, Monotonous Zakbar's video, right? Five, I was five minutes in. This is just very interesting. You know, I was watching it and I happened to look down. And at first I thought it was, you know, I was like, yeah, you know, the, the brother put this down here or, or something. But then I realized, check this out. When you do that, it's not under the video, you know, and he, you know, he does most of his videos in 16 by 9, if you will. So let's just go ahead and read it. This was very, very interesting. What caught my eye, of course, was what? Look at the bottom. 144,000. Who can learn that song? Let's read what this says. This is extremely interesting. And the water to Yahabashim Yahushai for sending me you know, the, the way of the apostles and the elders so I can learn the 100% truth and sing it my own damn self. All right. Check this out right here. I've been, let's see, uh, Ukraine or Crane. I don't know what the hell that was. Anyway, I've been on a news blackout for some time. I have been searching for an alternative that would. That, uh, that would tell me, and this is all caps right here, what happened, where it happened, when it happened, and maybe how it happened. With no editorializing, right? You know, uh, I guess that's going into a news, something, some kind of news that's telling you the truth, right? Uh, with, you know, with no straight, you know, as the apostle Gabar says, straight skinny, you know, no frills, no thrills. Let's keep going. Oh, boy. I found it. It is called 144,000. You see that? 144,000. I mean, it says 1440, but you know, that, that's what caught my eye. That's 100. It's 144. I see it every, everywhere, right? This is very interesting. It assumes you are smarter, smart enough to form your own without some partisan news media person, tell, person telling you how to think and worse, Filtering and slanding what they tell you. Okay? So, hey, again, through the, uh, the water to Yahabashim Yahushai for sending me this way. For, you know, it, this is beautiful. Through thy precepts, I gained understanding. And what I got out of that was it said you're smart enough, you know, to, to f basically see through the bullshit. That's what it said. This is very interesting. John 15 and verse 3. Now, this is red letters, Yahabashai speaking. Now, ye are clean. Through the word which I have spoken unto you. What did that say? Ye are clean through the word that Yahweh Bashim Yahushai has spoken to us. All right, so lucky. Let's go back from the top here. John 15 and verse 1. All right. I am the true vine, and my father is the husbandman. Verse 2. Every branch in me that beareth not fruit, he taketh away. And every branch that beareth fruit, he purgeth. He purgeth it. That it may bring forth, uh, it bring forth more fruit, and how and how so? You gotta have you gotta have an understanding of the Bible to bring forth fruit in the first place. To be a teacher, you know, given to uh, given to you by on high by Yahweh by Shimei This is this is awesome. I couldn't believe what I was seeing right there. There's 144 all over the place. Verse three. Now ye are clean through the word which I have spoken unto you. By the washing of the uh, uh, water by the word. You know, rivers of living water coming out of our bellies daily. Giving it out freely, man. Let's continue on. Oh, oh no. Verse four. Abide in me and I in you as the branch cannot bear fruit of itself. You see, accept it. it it's, I'm excited. I'm so excited. Let's go. Let's go. 
All right. Accept it. Abide in the vine. No more can ye uh, accept ye ab uh, abide in me. OK, you can't you can't do it. You can't do it of your own. It's the word. It's very interesting. Romans 11 and verse seven. What then? Israel have not obtained that which he seeketh for. What did that? What did that go back? Let's go. Let's go back and read it again. It said, well, "What? Well, when it happened, and maybe how it happened, with no editorializing, right? See, no frills, no thrills, just the truth of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai." Let's read it from the top. Romans eleven and verse seven. What then? Israel have not obtained that which he seeketh for, for, uh, for, but the election has obtained it, and the rest were what. Blinded. Do you, do you not have an unction from the Holy One? Did He not write this, write this uh, things aforetime for our learning? This is, this is this is very interesting. I don't know, and hopefully it's edifying. I hope you, I hope you brothers and sisters are getting something out of this, because I damn sure did when I saw that. Isaiah twenty-eight and verse nine: Whom shall He teach knowledge? In whom shall He make to understand doctrine? That's a you know, that's a whole big problem with a whole lot of people. I'd like the elder was going into it. Like I said, I was five minutes and 20 some seconds into his video. And it was a comment about somebody saying, well, what's wrong with watching Wi-Fi? What's wrong with watching this group or that group? Because they don't speak the same doctrine. You see, whom shall he teach knowledge and whom shall he make to understand doctrine? Them that are weaned from the milk and drawn from the breast, man. You know, you got to crawl before you walk. But as soon as you start running, hey, don't drop the plow. Let's go. Hebrews 13 and verse 17. Obey them that have rule over you and submit yourselves for they watch for your souls. That is, see that? For they watch for your souls as they, uh, as they that must give account that they may do it with joy and not with grief for that is unprofitable for you. See? Do it with joy and not with grief. Grief. And, uh, hey, again, the water to Yahweh Bashim Yahushua for sending me that way. I could have been easily involved in a different camp and, and all kinds of nonsense. And, you know, that's right. Bring it out. Believing in all kinds of madness, different doctrines that don't make no sense, man. This is beautiful. Proverbs 20 and verse 24. Let's go back. Mm-hmm. A just weight, right? You see, diverse weights, uh, verse 23. Diverse weights are an abomination unto the Lord Yahweh. And a false balance is not good. You see, a false balance is not good. And the rest of these camps, uh, two-thirds, the, the Christian church, uh, 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 ninjas, Eve, you know, got all kinds of false balance. Why? Because they are not doing what they're supposed to be doing. But hey. The election has obtained it, and the rest were blinded. Yahweh right to I'm a part of that number. You know, along with you uh, brothers that are diligent in teaching the, the same doctrine. The scripture said that we all speak the same thing. How could two walk together except they agree? Verse 25, verse 24. Man's goings are of the Lord Yahweh. How can a man then understand his own way? Hmm. See that? It is a snare to the man who... who uh, devoureth that which is holy and after vows to make uh, inquiry verse 26 a wise king scattereth a wise king scattereth the wicked and bringeth the will over over them verse 27 the spirit of a of man is the cattle salakia is the candle of the lord yahweh searching all the inward parts of the belly what did not did not quote hebrews uh, uh three and verse uh let's get it Let's get it. Let's just go ahead and grab it. I think it's 338. I'll, I'll, just, I'll just type it in this way. Mm-hmm. Hebrews. Look, come on now. 7 verse 38. Yeah, I was wrong. But I was, I was close. Close. John 7. It's John 7 and verse 38. He that believeth on me, as the scripture has said, out of his belly shall flow rivers of living water. I was thinking about a whole different scripture, but that's the one I wanted. There you go right there. Continuing on. I just got a couple more. We'll close out. First John 2 and verse 20. But ye have an unction. A what? An unction 
from the Holy One, and ye know all things. What group out there is telling you we got 100% truth? It's not a boasting thing or nothing like that. It is the truth. We know more than the prophets uh, uh, before us, which was us anyway. Why? Because we actually seeing the things come to pass. We seen it. Okay? It is what it is. Romans 15 and verse 4. Yeah, you got a whole lot of people out there. That, man, they said they know more than the prophets. Well, the prophet, we, if, if you was a prophet back then, you a prophet now. If you was a, a, a nasty, dirty-ass ratchet, Eve, you you the same damn thing now. Look at them. If you was a false prophet and a false teacher, look at them. Everybody's back in their lot. You think you're how about Shim Yahweh Shah is going to let all that slide? In Romans 15 and verse 4, for, who, for whatsoever... Things are written aforetime, were written for our learning. That, uh, that we, through patience and comfort of the scriptures, might have hope. You see? And that's that's what I'm talking about. That's the truth. That's the 100% truth. Okay? That's where we get it from. Verse 5. Now, uh, now, the most high power of patience. You hear that? My dog just scratching away, right? Anyway, of patience. Cause uh consolidate 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 nah get it right constellation Salakia grant you to be like minded one towards another according to Hamashiach Yahushai mm 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 to be what like minded I do are we not all supposed to speak the same thing right anyway I hope it was edifying just real quick through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashim Yahushai. I, I really thought that was, this was extremely interesting. 144, 144,000 mighty men. Who can learn that song except for the 144,000? Hmm. 12 of each tribe, right? Beautiful. Giving all praise, honor, and glory to the heavenly father and his only begotten son, Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rekakwadash, double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone, of whom I learn from daily. Healthy Shalom to all you brothers out there doing the work in truth and sincerity. In truth and sincerity. Also to the speckled bird that's going to come looking like every nation under the sun. It is what it is, and that's 100% truth. Now, every chance you get, chant this place down. DTA and Kwame Yasharala, Wild Bible Ball. Boom! Shalom.